Howdy cowdies, how you going? Hope you're okay. Weekly walkabout time of the collector. We've got heaps of cool stuff this week. More QSL radio cards. That little packet over the back that you can't really see. Um, so they're all from Ireland. I think a couple of them are handwritten and dated 1924. So from what I've gathered, I'm pretty sure they're going to be the first radio transmission sent from Australia to Ireland. There's some more of them there. There's ones over the back there are Australian ones. The one on top's got Mickey Mouse on it. All those ones have got sort of cool um, decoration and stuff like that on them. Little dinky toy Holden. Little bronze owls. And they aren't the only owls you'll see in this week's walkabout. See, there's some Wade ones. Like the little Japanese sort of giraffes over the back, song peppers. Nice bit of sterling silver, little Pierce bonbon dish. There's more lots of QSL cards in the cabinet as well. It's pretty cool, that with the Exxon Tiger on it there from America. Lovely little sort of fold over Victorian cards table. Nice sort of green felt lined top. Nice little pair of Victorian style decorative oil paintings. It's a lovely little watercolour of beach houses down at Brighton. Little Blackwood Auto trolley's nice. Display cabinet. Nice little sort of arts and crafts copper warming stand. Lovely little um, Sunderland table with the drop sides. How cool is that? The old Apple Mac. There you go, with all the keyboard, mouse and printer and everything. It's got a little box of accessories and stuff in there as well. All fires up and works. Pretty cool thing. Big cowskin rug. A couple of clocks. Some records. Footy cards and an old cricket bat. Xbox 360 that's got all the games and stuff to go with it and it works. Nice collection of glass and crystal. Some cool men's ties and cravats. Some other cool clothing. These are all sort of cardigans and stuff. Different sort of shirts and jackets. Some ladies gear. A couple of nice men's suits. This black pinstripe thing from the sort of 50s, 40s is a ripper. Vintage ladies stuff. More ladies gear. Some sports stuff. Men's stuff. And some cool robes. Including this one I think is Mr. Terry from California. Really cool thing. Um, ephemera, stuff, toys. There you go, some boxed Lego Ninjago. None of that's been opened. Uh, more toys, CDs, silver plate, gollies and stuff. There's Broski working on his motorbike. <laughs> more boxes of stuff and some other things. There's a head. Apparently his name's George. There you go. Big Kathleen Boyle mixed media. Not that you can see it, but there are but will be images online. A little box of English China, a little bit of Winton on top. Um, two boxes of mixed stuff, ephemera, magazines, kitchen alia and stuff. Cool old scales with these theatre craft weights, which is a bit unusual. Nice little box of mixed items, some good early Australian books, old bottles, Art in Australia magazines. A couple of nice big boxes of English China. Big lot of CDs and DVDs and stuff. So we've got big sort of 1970s oil painting there of the blue flowers. Pretty cool. Little collection of metal owls. Hand-painted cowboy tie and a cool cowboy handkerchief. Um, some little sort of salt and peps. Little toothpick holders. These are all little cloisonne owl thimbles. These are all little bits of owl sort of jewellery, brooches and stuff. And they're just cloisonne hooters. Advertising in ephemera. The cool rock and roll badges, Ramones, Kiss, The Vines, tables, You've got snowboards and scooters and stuff down under there. It's a cool big watercolour, Australian landscape, just can't remember the artist, Alan Hicks. There you go, group of pictures, a railway boom gate. There you go, we've even had to rearrange the room to fit this thing in. There's a nice pair of Victorian gents and ladies, nice big pair of club armchairs, lovely Victorian cedar dining table over the back, big church pews, a really nice thing as well, or just the bench seat, some nice Victorian chairs, Coca-Cola umbrella's cool, what else have we got, big railway light down the back corner there as well, a few old, old modern sort of skaties, cruisers and stuff, cool toys, what else have we got? Big industrial trolley, box of tools, 
nice little table, little outdoor concrete fountain. It's pretty amazing, this big bloody telescope. It's got like a tracking base or something like that. There's the telescope, fits on top of this thing. Really cool. Boxes of stuff. Old racer. Stereo gear. Black dragon tattoo sandwich board. Cool big sort of educational sort of poster. Map. More chairs and CDs. Elvis gear. Billy cart. And I can't get out down the back anymore. Right. Some cool hats and stuff in here. We've got some nice mid-century furniture, a little made in Norway, a little sewing table, Chiswell chairs and a nice little lamp, a little sort of Danish footstool here, another big railway light, African antelope dance headdresses, and a lovely big soft toy tiger. Uh, this owl lamp's pretty cool, alabaster and the eyes light up, nice little lot of china and glass, holly hobby, some good cassette tapes. Sort of royalty gear, China, nice jewellery box with some cool old High Street St Kilda Traders Association decals from 1969. There's some nice paintings this week. Arno Roger Ganesh, nice nude pastel. I think he won the Archibald Prize a few times. It's a nice Australian school thing, signed with initials lower right. Sort of river landscape sunset. Uh, Max Lyons etching. European school oil is a bit interesting from the 1930s. And this is Michael Taylor, mixed media. Harold Foster, lovely big English watercolour. A Somersetshire farmhouse. It's called cool Norny Good watercolour. Nice little sort of colonial, I think it's Ford. I think he's a New Zealand painter. What else have we got? I kind of like this little Aboriginal one, just can't remember who it is. Jank Rankin, Janky Rankin, little George Hyde Pownell watercolours a ripper, Dites Mill, and that's Dites Falls there on the Yarra, Graham Francella etching, or Aquitin I think it is, but yeah, some cool pictures this week, uh, an old sort of sight vision sign with some cool paint sets and other books, this electrotype specimens is a really cool thing. Trios, Oz Pottery. Big collection of pottery owls. There's some great stuff in there. Mainly Australian. Stuart, another glass and crystal. Little ukuleles, nice. From the Philippines. Dalton, more QSL cards. This is pretty cool. Uh, big sort of uh, three-dimensional or 3D poster there. Uh, Astro Boy, can't remember the artist. Canter, I think. 2014, it's got the glasses on the back. Cool little glass percolator, coffee, medicinal stuff. QSL cards, some shell owls, Australian pottery. Cool big Oz pottery teapot, really cool. And the sort of storyboard over the back. You got, it looks like a Tyrannosaurus Rex and a monkey and some other figures. And this guy looks like he's got a tennis racket. Well, I don't know. Uh, lacquerware, pubanalia. Nice little clock, box Lego Speed Champion, Ferrari Racer. This little axe is funny with a sort of carved serpentine stone blade. Uh, more QSL cards. Dunlop tennis ball box. Cool records, sort of soundtracks and sort of aeroplanes and things. More QSL cards, Australia. Nice little lot of glass, crystal, Royal Albert. Box Phillips double cassette deck from the 80s. Good Beatles records. Big Seepik River staff, nice big tribal sort of board or panel. Uh, corning ware, which for some reason is selling for money at the moment. <laughs> More house, collection of glass, a couple of nice little Aboriginal items. Eric Juck, oh, uh, sorry, Eric bloody Jucket. Gus McLaren pottery. More Australian pottery. More QSL cards. Oriental. More Oz pottery. More. Owls, really like this little hue and pine one. He's a ripper. Um, Winton, more Oz pottery, some interesting bits. That jug over the back's pretty wacky. Cutlery and some nice blue and white china. Spotlight, musical stuff, QSL cards. Kind of like the old ANA airline china. Mint boxed Hot Wheels, 
QSL, some more owls. This little one over the back's cool. The white owl cigar key ring. We give a hoot. <laughs> Diecasts, a mermaid jug. A couple of nice little bits of Aboriginal artifacts. This spear was a good one. It's been looks like it's been cut down or something. Uh, Shelley, Dalton, Royal Crown Derby, it's all there. Ramstein, QSL cards, Carlton Ware and Grimwades. Kind of like these little Perspex owls. This guy's cool the way his eyes sort of move, a bit optic. QSL cards, Brassware. Uh, more owls, a couple of bits of Gobels, a little sort of Duck Family and Mary. Uh, box Lego Lone Ranger, doesn't look like it's been opened. Fairy ear flap hat. Can't go wrong with one of them. Little owls are nice, one of them to sign I think Matt's Jonasson. Cool lot of old bike stuff, the big sort of dragster uh, reflector over the back, the big cat side to go in the back of your sissy bar. Uh, nice little collection of Carlton wear. These are really nice little watercolours. Jorgen, oh, I can't remember his name, it's in the catalogue. Painted up in Castle, Maine with Blamai Young. Uh, they're really nice, there's three of them there. Um, good records, Pixies and some other stuff. Australian Pottery, Walker and Hall, Clarinet. More Australian Pottery, Tintin, first edition. Nice little English retro coffee set. Another first edition Tintin. And this is Michael Boule, Australian Pottery vase there, a bit unusual. A couple of Rover teapots, more QSL cards. Hellfire Pottery Mug, Saddler, Old Lady Who Lived in a Shoot Teapot, some Nestle Australian Pottery, the Jar and the Mugs, another Tin Tin, really nice sort of 1950s Crusader, uh, tea set there with the Bakelite bases, a uh, big tankard over the back's a good bit, Ladro Clown's got a bit of damage unfortunately, this is nice, little Noritake Art Deco hand painted sugar and creamer. And Gail found out that that's, this pattern was only produced for Australia. There you go. This thing's pretty amazing. Huh? A coconut and a shell on top of each other that light up. <laughs> Big Blackwood tray's a ripper over the back. Midge Farrelly skateboard's a ripper. All original. Branding on the top there. Original sort of clay wheels. But actually still in the bearings and stuff. Still pretty good. Those two have been sort of reversed cone from the back. It's missing one of the base plates, as you can see there. These were produced with two base plates at one end and one at the other. So you could actually adjust the board for whether you wanted to do tricks or not. That's another cool old skatey. Cool pair of old roller skates. Some Joy Division records. Picture disc over the back is quite a rare thing. Um, these are all QSL cards from Russia. Sort of 1930s. Uh, it's a cool Saturday Night Fever poster with John Travolta. Nice bit of Carlton wear. <laughs> tin Tin. Mini Malone. Another Tin Tin. Nice little English China coffee set. QSL cards from China and other interesting places. Uh, little Goebbels. Goebbels Glass Owl and a Beswick one. Martin Boyd. Nice little Oz Pottery wall mask. First edition book. More QSL cards, they're all from New Zealand. It's a lovely little Chinese sort of silk shawl, or it's a little scarfy type thing, embroidered. Lovely bit of cloisonne. A couple of nice bits of the carnival glass and the pot in the corner. Nice little pair of Oz pottery. I think they're signed Kathy Allen on the back. They're really quite nice. The one underneath's got a kangaroo on it. And the top shelf, we've got some nice gear. Troika, Derbyshire, Bennett's. Uh, McLaren, Carnival, she's nice little bronze Japanese, sort of Huygenauer style, can't remember the name of the art glass, it's Australian, Matthew Larwood maybe, but I'd be wrong, uh, that's a nice little bit of Italian, Greg Daly, Dalton Siliconware vases, another really nice bit of Troika, lovely little bit of Martin Boyd, really like that. Uh, Carnival, sweet little bit of Dalton Pansy. This is nice, this reverse cut glass prism. There you go, it's all cut in the back and underneath. Lovely thing. But there you go guys, that'll do. I could talk shit for another half an hour. <laughs> but that shall do. Hopefully you see you on Thursday night, it's going to be a good sale.